have always really loved Marvel movies. Madam Web was very enticing to me. Hi! Cassie Webb. This movie is before she ends up in a wheelchair. She's hyper intelligent and her greatest superpower is her mind. I knew he was gonna die. I saw it. When Cassie begins to experience her clairvoyance, she thinks she's losing her mind. You are the only one who can change the future. Madame Web is unlike any other superhero. When you're thinking about how Spider-Man flies through the air or Venom when he changes, it's so mythical to us. But with her, it's all psychological. I can see the future. And I found that incredibly exciting to explore. Let's try that again. These visions are quite fragmented because she doesn't see anything clearly. I've seen that man before. So who is he? Ezekiel Sims. He was in the Amazon with my mom right before she died. Madame Web brings these four superheroes worlds together. You don't think this is weird, how we're all connected? It's honestly like the least weird thing that's happened all day. It's the genesis and the inception of what will become. You're showing off. Maybe a little. Madam Web is a truly dynamic character. Hi! It's Cassie Webb. When you first meet Cassie, she is a paramedic in New York City and doesn't really let people in. You have a winning personality. I guess I got yours by mistake. <laughs> and then things take quite a turn. Cassie! When Cassie begins to experience her clairvoyance, she thinks she's losing her mind. This is an emergency, get off the train! In this one moment, Cassie connects all three of their lives. That man is trying to kill you. Madame Webb's powers are really interesting. She's able to see into the future, and because she's able to see it, she's able to prevent it. Let's try that again. It's really interesting how it plays on fate or destiny. You don't think this is weird, how we're all connected? honestly like the least weird thing that's happened all day this film and this story is different because it's really grounded in reality i don't understand what's happening i think i'm seeing the future through her clairvoyance she understands that she needs to save these three girls this is an emergency get off the train it is more of a suspenseful thriller that man's trying to kill you which is unique from anything you've seen in a superhero movie. If you want to live, you have to trust me. It has mystery embedded in the story. You don't think this is weird, how we're all connected? It's honestly like the least weird thing that's happened all day. What do you want? It's got psychologically mind-bending scenarios that you're just going to be stumped on. Let's try that again. Madam Web is unlike any other Marvel movie. Julia, get down! It's genuinely refreshing. Get ready. To see a superhero movie, that's really different. Ezekiel Sims is a fascinating villain. He seeks out a secret tribe in Peru who possess inhuman strength and health. I've been searching for that spider for years. And these powers, they allow him to see into the future, including his own death. He's trying to change what happens. If you want to live, you have to trust me. He becomes obsessed with finding his killers first. If you knew what I knew, you'd do the same thing. The question is, does knowing his future save him from it? Madam Webb's a different type of superhero story. I've been having visions. She sees things that she doesn't know if they're dreams. I don't understand what's happening. It's like in blips. She'll experience the future and the present. I think I'm seeing the future. Not only is she able to see it, but she's able to change it. Get off the train! That man's trying to kill you. Who are you? What is going on? This film and this story catapults her into discovering her superpowers. I can see the future. Oh, she didn't see that coming? That's <laughs> not how it works. There's all of these different webs that she's putting together. I've seen that man before. I have no idea what those girls have come. Ezekiel is able to see that all three of us develop into the superheroes that ultimately kill him. He's trying to change what happens. Get down! Hope you enjoyed your behind the scenes look. 
Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you here next time. Later.